Well, living with dementia isn't easy, and caring for someone with dementia can be even harder financially and emotionally. But as Kega 9's Maria Stobbs reports, there's new funding available to help loved ones. Doing something as simple as helping a senior cook or make a cup of coffee can stimulate their brain, which senior helpers tells me can help prevent dementia. We don't have a cure for Alzheimer's and dementia. You know, all of this research that is happening, um, all we can do is just help the symptoms. But it gets expensive, costing on average four to $11,000 a month for caregiving options in Tucson, according to Jen Worth. For family members, it takes them out of work and into an unpaid job. All these caregivers that have uh, unpaid hours, they're suffering from some illnesses themselves, frustration, depression. A new federal program allows those loved ones a break from caregiving. Now with Medicare covering respite care for those with Alzheimer's. They are going to pay for up to 80 hours uh, a year and it resets every year. Giving families a chance to also reset. It's a resource Greg Levitt says he would tap into if he has to care for his brother. He's having a lot of uh, issues with memory and to be honest, there have been times when I just have to uh, watch myself because it's so frustrating. The funding providing relief for the nearly 300,000 caregivers in Arizona, the fastest growing state for Alzheimer's, according to the Alzheimer's Association. Let them go away for four hours, you know, uh, two, three days a week and do what they need to do. And let a caregiver step in. I look forward to the uh, three days a week that I have somebody come by and give me a hand. A helping hand. That's good. Making a difference. Reporting from Marana, Maria Stobbs, KGUN 9. <laughs>